We're now joined on the phone by a political science professor at Tel Aviv University, Emmanuel Navone. Thank you for joining us. Good morning. Uh, good morning to you, too. Uh, so compared to what we've seen recently, Great Britain, Great Britain, Sweden, and Spain, what's the significance of the vote upcoming in the French Parliament? Well, first of all, also in the French Parliament, the initiative is of political parties from the left of the socialist uh, parties and not from uh, conservative uh, parties. The significance will be similar. In other words, it has no significance because it is not binding. It is not a government decision. It is only a symbolic decision, uh, which is not binding upon the government. Well, what do you think Israel can or, or should do in response to this wave of symbolic votes across Europe? Well, I think that the message that Israel should send to those uh, parliaments is very clear, which is that the message they're sending, that these parliaments are sending to the Palestinians, is that they really do not have to negotiate with Israel because at the end of the day, all the demands will be recognized and accepted by the international community. So it is really not improving the chances of reaching a peace agreement. In addition, in addition, none of these parliaments are asking the Palestinians to abandon the so-called right of return as a condition to be recognized, because for the past 20 years, the main obstacle to the two-state solution has been the Palestinian insistence on the so-called right of return, which of course is incompatible with the two-state solution. And here we don't hear any European Parliament asking the Palestinians as a condition for recognition to abandon this so-called right of return. And I think this is the message, the very clear message that Israel should send to the international community. Well, thank you very much for your time this morning, Dr. Emmanuel Nabonis.